Hey everyone, welcome to another Line No Trains review. Today we're talking about the 736 Berkshire. This is a really sad moment for Line No. It was the end of the post-war era, and you can see a major change in uh, in um, cutting costs and also the times have come. This version of the Berkshire is the last version. The tender has plastic trucks. And even this version, the tender number, which used to be right over here, has been eliminated due to save production costs. As you can see, this one was never used. The block paint is scary. It looks like 1966 all over again. This is one of the last big locomotives made by Lino. And the times have changed so much that the tender box is just plain white it's stamped 736w and that is it we're all famous with the orange tender boxes that Lionel made years prior the locomotive box has even changed the window display has been eliminated and the master car doesn't even say Lionel on it. it just says 736 Really sad to see how Line now ended up after all the quality throughout the years. Shortly after this time frame, Line now was sold to General Mills. And the pre-war and post-war era under the Line now Corporation was gone. Anyway, let's talk about different variations of the 736. The first version was introduced in 1950 and had silver lettering. It was available until 1951. In 1952, production ceased due to war efforts. In 1953, the 736 was introduced, but came with white lettering and remained unchanged. Sometime late 1955, another cost-saving measure was introduced. We'll use this one as an example because it has the same truck. The die-cast metal truck was changed from a die-cast to this plastic, more economical type. And then after that, it was changed again. We'll use this one as an example. The pickup roller assembly was shortened. And also, instead of having two screws and a nameplate, had, had, this one has now one screw and was shortened. This is the same pickup roller, so I'm using this as an example. And then... The 736 was changed again in 1961. Every one after 1961, the tender came with plastic trucks. Early early ones from 61 to 64, it says here 736W in, in the uh, black spot there. After 1964, that was even eliminated to save money. As you can see this one, the wheels are very clean. Looks to be never used. I mean, look at the paint. That's pretty impressive. Let's take a look underneath. Just very minor oxidation, but otherwise very light run time, if any. Look at the pickup rollers. Look to be only test run. We also have here the original smoke bottle, which was never opened. Lionel made these rounds in the late 60s. Pretty cool. We also have the smoke plunger. We even have the warranty card. Wow, look at this. The Lionel Service Company. Hoffman Place, Hillside, New Jersey. How to get service under the terms of the line now warranty. Wow. Pretty cool. Pretty cool time capsule. And we even have the original instructions. Here are other versions 
of the MasterCards that the 736 came in. This one dates post-1964 to 68. 61 to 64. And 55. Uh, I'd say maybe 57, 55 to uh, 61. Pretty cool to have all three versions here. There's actually a version with the red, famous red from 1950 for the first one. Anyway, um, thanks for watching. And uh, it's pretty cool to see the end of line out here with all the different boxes. I know some people probably never even saw a white tender box. But anyway, thanks for watching and uh, have a good day.